Welcome to Society of Amateur Radio Astronomers. This is Radio Astronomy, Constant Variables and Formulas, Lesson 1, Parabolic Dish Antenna Gain Calculation. Parabolic Dish. Parabolic Dish collects radio waves and redirects them to a focus. The shape is meant to have all the beams coming from whatever angle hits the uh, dish into that focus. This is where you normally put your feed in order to collect all the signals that's being collected by the antenna. What is antenna gain? It is the measure of the directionality of the antenna. Antenna gain is efficiency times quantity of pi d squared pi d over lambda squared all that you make and you times 10 log efficiency of an antenna if you are an amateur antenna and not very well made it's probably closer to 50 percent if you're a high-end antenna uh and uh it's probably closer to 85 percent pi is your normal uh, value of 3.14259 Diameter is uh, of the antenna is D in meters. Wavelength is the speed of light over frequency. Let's go over an example problem. If your parabolic dish is one meter in diameter with an efficiency of 50% and your frequency you're measuring is 1420 megahertz, which is the hydrogen line, your wavelength is three times 10 to the eighth meters per second over 1420 times 10 to the sixth per second. And 10 to the sixth is megahertz equals 0.21 meters. If you put your lambda in that formula along with the 0.5 and the pi and the one meter, uh, you get the below equation and that is equal to 20.49 dBi. Let's go to a bigger antenna. If your diameter is three meters and we have an increase in efficiency of 65% and you're measuring at a slightly lower frequency of 1260 megahertz, then your wavelength is equal to 0.24 meters and your gain, plug that all the way through, is equal to 30 dBi. So you get a, almost a 10 dBi bump by increasing the efficiency and increasing the diameter to three meters from a one meter dish. If you like this video, like and subscribe. Join Sarah to start your hobby of ra amateur radio astronomy. You join by going to our website, www.radio-astronomy.org. Thank you.